So there's certain time in a, an individual's life that makes them reflect on where they've been and where they're going. I'm at one of those. I am three days away from turning 40. Kind of had my life all together about a year ago. And then stuff just kind of started unraveling and I'm kind of floating around. Not sure what I want to do now. This blog is going to be about that adventure. So I suppose I should start off by telling you kind of what happened that got me to where I was. Um, and then from there, what my, my plans for the future are. So in the last year, my, uh, my boys were both adults in the last 12 months. My oldest uh, is, turned 18 a year and a half ago. About a year ago, he started getting into trouble. Ran off, got arrested twice. Drug trafficking. Yeah, not some minor shit either. Got arrested for drug trafficking. So that uh, kind of caused me to have a little bit of a nervous breakdown. Uh, you know, I'd been suffering from depression my whole life and, and fighting with that. And when he uh, went off reservation, it just kind of pushed me beyond what I could do, beyond what I could bear. Um, past that, um, my mom had a stroke, moved in with me. Fine, no problem. I can, it's good. I can handle that. Uh, I got admitted to the hospital for the mental health issues when my son lost his, uh, got himself arrested, lost his way. And I'm not blaming that on my son. I just, that's, that was the breaking point. You know, I, I struggled long before that, but that's, that's what snapped. That was the, I hate to call it a straw because it was bigger than any, any little straw, but that's the, uh, that's the bail that broke the camel's back, I guess you'd say. Next up on my list of, of I had my life together and I don't anymore, I got laid off from work. Um, reduction of force. My position was eliminated. So they weren't replacing me, they weren't hiring somebody else, they just cut the job. Ten years of the company, um, slowly moving up the ranks, started off as a customer service rep, uh, was working as a, as a manager at the time, and I'm done, you know, I'm out. Um, with all that going on, my, my youngest son, who doesn't get along with my girlfriend, moves back in and She's got her own issues and decides that she's gonna leave. So now my girlfriend's moved out. I found it difficult, a lot more difficult than I thought it would be to find a new job. So now I'm kind of in that uh, stage that I don't know what I wanna do with my life. And I've, I've still got severance. I'm still getting paid for another month and a half, but I've been unemployed for five months now. Mostly. I mean, I've, I've decided to go the small business route. So the small business route is I do real estate photography. In addition, I work as a volunteer firefighter or paper call firefighter where I get paid every time I go out on a run. And a uh, volunteer squadsman, so an emergency medical technician for the local squad. Uh, technically a volunteer, but I do get paid a stipend for every shift. Um, so between that and the photography gig and my mom living with me and she gives me a little bit each month toward uh, what she used to pay for her rent she pays me now. So between all of that, I'm making enough that, that I can live. So since I'm doing that, I kind of feel that I got an opportunity to go back to school. So the question is, is what do I do? Do I, do I finish off my bachelor's degree? That's a given. I've got, I've got two classes uh, to finish my bachelor's, so I have to do that. There's no, no question there. But beyond that, do I want to go to nursing school? Do I want to go to paramedic school? Uh, do I want to go on and get my MBA? Do I want to try to find a, you know, keep fighting to find a regular job? There's a lot of questions that I just don't kind of know. So this blog is going to be about a couple of things. It's going to be about where I'm going next. And right now what I'm leaning toward is, is going to paramedic school. I'm trying to get a job on the squad full time. Um, it's two minutes from my house, just running up there, make that my life. Do that until I can't do it anymore and then go back into business or something. Um, so with that, as you can see, I'm a heavy dude. And 
that I really need to work on getting in shape. So the second thing this blog is going to be about is weight loss. It's going to be my struggle, what I'm doing, how I'm doing with that. It's, it's just it's a personal journal. Uh, but that's going to be kind of the second theme. And then the third theme is just talking about my mental health, how I'm doing, how am I dealing with my depression, uh, and those sort of things. So I thank you guys for taking this the six minutes out of your life uh, to listen to me ramble for a little bit. Again, my name is Jay, and I really need to figure out what I'm going to do for an outro for these videos. I might even make that my outro. One of these days, I'm going to figure out what I'm going to say. You say goodbye to everybody when I'm done talking to you. Y'all have a great night. I'm out.